Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. I was playing the game for a little while before starting it, basically just running through the night. We're at 4 in the morning right now, and something hit me a couple of game hours ago and thought I would start here. You know, see what I'm looking at? The refrigerator is empty. This is the old refrigerator. Everything has been shipped over. So that happened a lot faster than I thought. I thought it would take a whole winter. It took only half the winter. So this is... We actually have quite a full freezer over here, too. Um, we're going to mine more of it out eventually, but uh, that's the idea. This side would be meat, this would be both. And having a little problem here with the butchering. And Give me your thoughts on how to streamline this. We butcher over here. We pick up the animals, we butcher them, we put them. The idea was in here, fairly close. And then as the refrigerator runs out, it will get moved from there into here. And as these get emptied, it will move from here into here, and the dogs will take care of all that. Except that until we get these full, and this full, and this full, everything's being walked all the way down and dropped off there. And it's taken forever to get the butchering done. So I guess we're just going to have to wait until we get to this point. But uh, if I set this at the same priority as this, it's all going to go here because it's closer, and the cooks are just going to have to walk into there for every single meal to get five at a time. So I guess we're stuck with this very inefficient long walk to the butcher table every time until we get so much meat in that we finally start to fill up. So by episode 150, we'll have meat in here. <laughs> anyway, Klaus got healed through the night and he is back. He just went to bed. He dropped off all of his clothes walking around here naked, so I didn't want, you know, didn't want to embarrass him by recording that, but uh, he, uh, he didn't like anything that got shredded in that, uh, that explosion he was in. Dropped it all off and went searching for other stuffs. So he's now got just a Synthread jacket on, right? Synthread jacket. He looks quite different from his cowboy western look that he's he's been sporting all this time so hopefully kaya can get in and and get more of the uh, the new clothes made and and get all of us outfitted again and, and good stuff because we are really out of dusters we have this one at 54 percent and i couldn't find any more that weren't uh, that didn't belong to to dead people i don't see any in here Unless I'm just missing them. There's a few of them over here from the bodies that got cremated, and that's it. And this guy is one of the reasons why I started recording instead of taking it till uh, first light. But let's look through what we have got going on here. I saw Tomislav just got up. He is relaxing socially. He was asleep all this time, but he's up. And what is his plan? Because Natalia is down there researching. So, so Tomislav, your first two puts you into growing. Okay, that's probably wise. Growing or construction, but we've got most of our of our repairs done. We just have a few traps yet to go. Um, so you're fine. Shantigo's up too. He wasn't yeah that just happened too. So he's they're both uh, I guess after our, our battle last time they're pretty uh, much in need of getting their joy up. Tomislav too. Yeah so at least they get to that notch I'm guessing the whatever that is, 80% or something, then they should trigger to go off and do uh, do other things. Shantigo, of course, lives right next to the kitchen, so he'll probably just drop right in and get to work. He doesn't need a he doesn't need a meal. All right. Um, who else is up? Natalia is researching, and is going to need to break soon, which means Thomas will probably jump in once she takes a break, and then she will be doing what? Natalia, your one is research, your two is smithing. So you'll probably get in here and start working on the rest of that... Uh, Auto pistol. Okay. And then Michael, he wasn't up either. Boy, they all made a transition on me. I, I was, I've was. i been working with like f maybe four or five of them for the, for the last few minutes trying to get to like eight in the morning. So Michael, you, I went through and since our clothes are all torn up right now, I, I dropped the, uh, um, the requirements from what I had set of say range 61 percent down to 51 percent so that there's more clothing that qualifies i'm going to make the guess that 50 percent and less uh, uh gives them the whatever the that disqualifier was that uh, that mood debuff um something like ragged or 
tattered clothing. A tattered clothing, I think it is. I'm guessing it's 50% or less. I'm not sure. So if I keep them above 51, they should be fine. I've kept above 61 all this time just to make sure we're definitely fine. But uh, we're getting a little sparse on our new clothing. Um, Miss B, you are butchering, taking the long walk in. Okay, but you have managed to fill both of these and got two piles going. So we're kind of slowly getting there. Um, David has been stuck here in the prison most of the time. He did do a, a quick change of clothes, but otherwise he's uh, working on, on trying to convince some of these guys. And speaking of some of these guys, I had a conversation with, with Daniel this afternoon trying to figure out how best to get people into the series and I do have a tool at my disposal I really I've, I've you know I really want Bill to have purple that, that was a conversation we had probably 15 episodes ago and purple has been stubborn the whole time so I I, I would have never guessed you'd take this long to recruit in the dev tools there is a tool that gives you an instant recruit and I wanted to play the game without using too many dev tools. I really, you know, to me that feels like cheating, but in another sense, it isn't. I mean, really, I'm choreographing a story here. So we can alter things a little bit in order to get the story moving along. And Purple has really been a roadblock to our story lately. I could just recruit him and be done and get moving on to get more subscribers into the game a little bit quicker of course we do that too many times and this isn't going to be looking this full anymore we're going to have three people making meals and still sitting with a a pretty sparse meal fridge because we're going to be eating so many more so there is that to think about to what extent do we want to speed up this process um so give me your thoughts about that but um I believe that Faith is the last female subscriber that has asked to be in the game that, that I have a record of. So if there's any others, let me know that I've missed you. But otherwise, there's a couple of guys that have changed their name a little bit so they could become a female character too, since we seem to always have so many extra female characters available to us. Otherwise, there's a list of, I think it's 16 guys that want to be in the game and of that 16 guys i'm sure there's at least half of them that are no longer watching anymore or at least haven't left a comment in the in the the comment section in a long time so my next group is bill baldrick norman pavel gnarly and choctaw and then oaths after that so of that group um why don't you guys let me know who uh um, who's still around, who's still watching, just leave me a, a hello in the comments and that you're still interested. And so I'll know who to start you know, aiming um, um, Decker and Klompster toward, as well as who Maymay gets to be when she gets recorded, because she, prisoner, 78%. Who's the, the, real, oh, the real easy one we're getting rid of? That was Kina, 67%. She's just a little bit too... Uh, going to be too explosive for us <laughs> the psychically hypersensitive and depressive combined oh that's just a guaranteed disaster in fact she and olga just healed in the last few minutes before i started recording so let's set them while i'm thinking about it to uh um release let's get them going so we can concentrate on the ones that we want i really don't want to just take anybody because i'd like to have some decent characters in here and everybody wants to have a decent character to have their name on so there are certain ones that uh, i think would be best just to say goodbye to and see what the next random character comes in and you know that could be at any time but so gets food yeah so that's release on olga and release on kina everyone else is chat and recruit prisoner chat and recruit chat and recruit and chat and recruit okay and i had said that hmm clomster was our best potential melee character but i forgot that purple right there is actually one better he's a 12 and he knows how to shoot he's a decent character doesn't have a lot of real strong traits otherwise but we'll train him up into something he's psychically death which is a huge bonus though a prosthophile is a problem because we have seen so few bionic parts available made available to us so that negative is going to be there for for him for most of the game but that all said and if i gone through it all sea stars has been in charge of trying to get fuel back into these generators 
because we are getting dangerously low on our first bank. We may have to tap our second bank. We'll see how well the uh, uh, the solar panels do for us. Grandma has been cooking away and doing a good job. We get two of these going for half a day. We've got our 60 just like that. It's just a matter of them having a chance to do that. It was suggested that we get beyond 60 in our reserve, and maybe that is a thing. I've been resisting that because if we get a... Uh, a solar flare or something and all power goes out we have so many more that are gonna just spoil and be thrown away on us but uh, we seem to be eating them pretty quickly right now so yeah let's go ahead and take, kick it up to oh, one notch it's just that the further we go with this the harder it is to get back into prepackaged survival meals which I want sitting in the prison I've had to move a big pile of of uh, where am I at Right over here of the fine meals into here because of that we just weren't making any of the others because we were behind but if we were to set this for 25 more just because that's easy yeah i guess so so you and you details 25 more and you just to get that into the uh into the works for if we ever do use the stove okay so there's that and then eventually we're going to look at i think i've got 20 meals set for here as far as prepackaged two sets of 10 and i've got 10 up in here uh right there for us in an emergency situation but then eventually this goes away we move into here which i think we want to get doing pretty soon but there's 10 in each one of these so we're eventually going to be needing 120 meals plus another 20 in one of these shelving units which i did spend some time between episodes and set up some more of our jail what would look like some kind of a processing center in here i'm thinking in fact I'm, i might make these doors i'm kicking around hmm maybe this door goes away this one stays here i don't know i, got, I like the second access though but the idea is that they come in through here and this, there's the counters right here with chairs behind them, and there'd be staff in there checking them in. There's a place for people to sit, to sit, and maybe visitors would would sit in there before they get a chance to go visit their, you know, their their loved ones in in the in the cells or something. So kind of a of a of a well, we'll come up with a name for this room, but a processing room of some kind before we hit the the main room where. You know, we'll have three main hospital beds set up and otherwise these will be hospitals as they as they get healed and I will we'll have to see how this works they'll they'll be moved into a cell these will all be beds normal prisoner beds these will all be hospital beds so they won't be able to sleep anywhere in here so will our warden automatically pick them up and take them into one of these rooms because there no, no longer is a bed for them. So we'll see how the game works with that. That is really gone. Power conduit. All right, copy you and drop you in there. I wonder what happened to that door. Um, otherwise, there's the furnishings for this room. Got that all laid out. A lot of steel stuff. Steel beds in here. Steel nightstands and tables. Then wood around the perimeter because steel is, is a little bit sparse right now. Um, we're wood in the cells. So we're not going to quite have the, the the full jail look that I would want. Otherwise, if I hit everything that's been going on through the night, um, I think so. We're pretty well set in here. So the last event that just hit was a mad animal. And we're all kind of busy. I can get someone up there to take care of it. But I'm curious to find out what happens if we have a mad animal coming in. And there's, uh, you know, there's no one to deal with it. Will any of these traps trip? will these two turrets which are on 24 7 now rec receive it as an enemy you know uh, deal with it on their own so i'm curious to see what's going to happen here oh 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 why would you turn around you are you're going after a granite auto door interesting all of our enemies will run the gauntlet but an animal will decide that the easiest way in is right here you got to think there's a different set of programming behind this guy as our enemies. Because the other enemy should have stopped right there and, and kicked their way in too. Alright, you're going through the traps. You're missing every one of them. Alright, this isn't looking good. <laughs> okay, looks like we got to get somebody out here. Or at least, I don't think he's going to attack our animals. I think he's only going to attack people. So, really just need to be aware of who's out here. He's going to get all the way down into here to go after us, which we could then 
you know, set a couple people in here and shoot it. But I'd like to see if the turrets will do the job. But will the turrets hit our own animals? Mm, there is that. It'd be nice if these turrets were on. Because they could shoot right into there. Yeah, probably so. Let's trip this one just to just to test the theory here. That's I always hit that one instead of this one. There, and sea stars, let's kind of reset you. You're gonna do that, and then you're gonna refill that for me. Thank you. So there, trip. Going around the corners. I just expected these would, you know, with a lesser chance, still trip. But he's missing all of them. We're live here now. We have a pig head in that direction. But just wanted to see what would do if we didn't do... Oh, the doors are open. Why are the doors open? Okay, well, that was a little unexpected. Boom, boom, boom. Well, they did, though, automatically um, trigger him as an enemy. And that's good to see. But not fast enough. Okay, who's out here? Alicia's out here. And you're going after Alicia. Yep, so Alicia, I need you to fire at... Eh? You've got a pistol. Why can you not fire at... Can I hit target? Why can't you hit target? There's a line of sight issue. Oh, go over here. Fire at. Run. <laughs> um, I need to get you mm, back into turret range. All right, your running speed is, well, it's really slow right now. 3.4 in here. Fox's running speed is 4.2. Hmm. Let's get you inside here. Go there. Grandma. Draft. Boy, there's just, there's no line of, fight, uh, line of sight here. There's really not. Let's get you to here. He's going to give up on Alicia and come in further. Okay. David, you, and who else is here? Click sideways. Who, there's, there's, I'm only getting one person. Really? Oh, you're carrying somebody. Oh, you're releasing Olga. That could be interesting. Olga may fight the fox for us. We'll see. <laughs> Tomislav, why don't you come give me a hand over here? Come on up into this area as well. And anybody else nearby? Alicia's there. Harvey and Charlotte. They're dogs. Ham's up there. I'm not seeing any peoples. No peoples. Okay. So we have Faith there. We have Grandma there. We have David there. Nobody in bed over here. Nobody. There's no cooking left. Kaya releasing Kina. Kaya had a shooting skill of 8. Draft. You're going to have to deal with Keen a little bit later. Pop up in this area as well. Okay, Alicia. Can you? You cannot. Mm. You're going to take a bite. You are going to take a bite. How many bites are you going to take? Or do I just keep you shooting at it? I think I just keep you shooting at it. Fire at the fox. You guys all... Nope, not you. Uh, Grandma, head over to here and Kaya head over to here Thomas Bob you're heading out here too right you are too both of you come on over here okay so Kaya or Alicia this is yours just stop missing okay in fact stay where you are because this one cannot hit you I think I think you're in cover to this can I tell this doesn't let me see that does it it does. 12% chance. Fox is 16% chance. Hmm. I thought we tried getting that information off of a turret once before, and it wouldn't tell me. Interesting. Okay, well, um, Fire Ad is not working. That's interesting. She hasn't shot in a long time. We are definitely firing out. I get an X. And yet, gear, revolver, information... Touch range is 51%, yet we can't use it for touch. Unless touch is another way of saying melee. Huh. What am I not getting here? She should be able to shoot point blank if touch means, you know, touch. Hmm. Okay, well, um, hopefully that column hides you. Oh, you shot that time. Did I not say fire it before? I don't know. 
I guess I did. It did fire there once before. Okay. I've been seeing the fox doing all this moving. I thought she was doing some moving back. Okay, that's that's my fault. I'm wrong there. But she is hitting him. Boom, boom, boom. Got him. Okay. Alicia, how bad? And I guess next time we just won't trust the traps to work with animals. There's just... The odds are too small. Of course, you know, we did kind of uh, give them a, you know, a, a free trip out of the, our last four traps, but came down through here and turn. Yeah. Oh, well. So with that, Alicia, health, what'd you get? Oh, man. You got, uh, you got torn up pretty good here. Not in immediate danger, but you got to scratch a crack, a bite, scratch, 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 bite. Um, anything important? Crack in the jaw, scratch in the head. But mm, only a bite in the right hand is, is serious. Okay. So Alicia needs, go grab a meal. You, uh, you're not squirrel skin. You can grab a meal on your way to the hospital. That might be the best thing for you. Consume a meal and then drop into this bed. Uh, turn all that off and try it again. Consume a meal, reserved by. Consume a meal and then hop into bed. Okay, um, I need somebody else nearby. Tomislav, you guys undraft. And Tomislav, I want you to turn off that switch. Boy, it is hard to click one character down in here. There's a lot of a lot of confusion. Grandma, how about you? You want to go train a wild boar. Why? You've been cooking all this time. I guess you're still set for animal handle ahead of time. Do we want to continue that? She's decent at animal handling. She's also decent at cooking. But Michael is too. We could leave her on both. She can cook the first part of her evening shift. No, no, she can She can animal handle the first part when there's still animals active. Then she could cook through the night, and then she could finish her night shift working with animals when they start to wake up. Okay, that seems to work pretty good. I like that. Um, okay, so Grandma, yep, yeah, you go for it. Kaya, I want you to recruit... Well, I wish Klaus would get up. I want to get his recruiting skills going. Um, Kaya, can you hunt that fox. Mm. We're going to shoot up whatever this is. Cloth Park at 90%. I wonder if it'll work that way. Well, I guess we'll find out. Let's go ahead and hunt Red Fox. Alicia, you're done. You're going to go and get healed. And what are you wearing? You are wearing Olga's power armor. No? Interesting. It must have been somebody else with Oh, Olga. Did she leave with power armor? David, where are you at? David, you already let her go. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. I should have stripped her and taken her power armor away. Yeah, we lost that opportunity. Uh, gear. Yeah. Okay, I didn't know a second one had power armor, but uh, Alicia is immune to the penalty from wearing a dead man's gear and so she got herself a nice set of power armor and a power armor helmet good going her and good alpaca pants and also yeah all dead man clothes she's got the 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 pick of all the loot that comes in from our our little battles so good for her that probably saved and she just thumbs down kaya <laughs> So, what do we have here? Slighted Kaya as you walk by. You didn't get here fast enough to save me. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> now you get all the credit for hauling in the fox. <laughs> anyway, that is RimWorld. Now, we need to get these doors closed. I'm sure whoever walks through this next is going to get that done. Um, let's see. Who was down there doing what... I was thinking of Kaya. You are, you were heading down into here. I need someone else to get down in here. Um, yeah, Klaus, where are you at? You're right there. Needs. You're pretty much done. Let's work on. We have Strip. We have May May, Clumpster, and Decker. Um, let's just get you in here. Chat with Decker. Chat with May May. 
Now nah, we'll go for Decker. So hop in there and get get your day started and get your uh, your social skills up and running. We've got Kina being dropped off. Kina, I don't think had anything that was important for us to to hang on to, so that's fine. And I guess we can get started now that we're 25 minutes into this. <laughs> um, so what are our priorities right now? Be nice to get a couple of these rooms done and the first half of this one done. Start getting things transferred over. Kind of like that idea. Be nice to get more of the research done. Uh, Tomislav's back on that job now. So we can get, well, we're going on two thirds of the uh, uh, com component assembly table done. So we can get components being uh, created with the last components that we have available with our, our down ships, parts, and boy, you're moving fast. You are all in here doing something. That was really weird. You are wandering. It's like these all ate something, something that used to be there, and now it's not. Health, no injuries. I think we're getting to where food is starting to become scarce. We're going to see our animals leaving soon. The Ibex. Oh, hello. What have you been eating? Hmm, we have a grizzly bear on the scene now. There was an Ibex over here that I wanted Klaus to go get, but he wanted to go to sleep. So I went ahead and left him. And I see something's eating him. Unless there is a pig on his way down with an Ibex that I don't see. I don't think so. No, over here. No. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, what are you? No, you're being butchered right now. Okay. No, so I think we lost that last animal of that hunt. And so we've got got a grizzly. What else has moved in? We probably have to do another hunt here real soon. Just to keep the meat coming in, to keep us going. I wish we could get another uh, event, another migration herd coming through. That was so easy to, to fill the freezer with. But I don't see it. Hmm. Now, Klaus is on a 24-hour... Um, work inspired frenzy. So, what just popped over there? I don't know what that. Whoa! Matt animals plural? Squirrels? Huh? Some sort of psychic wave has swept over the landscape. Your colonists are okay, but it seems many of the squirrels in the area have been driven insane. Jump to location. Ah, <sighs> you know. When I saw that, where were we? Over in here? That boom rat come running down. And I saw another one in our in the this tunnel right in here. I think he was doing this, or there was another one down in there, right in there. I was thinking, oh, it just crossed my mind. Boy, if we have a psychic event where we've got, you know, the full group of animals going crazy and then boom rats, this could be really bad. I wish I had said it, because <laughs> that would have been quite the coincidence. But that's what was on my mind when I was seeing them moving so quickly in here. It just And it seems like there's an awful lot of boom rats all of a sudden. So we've got a whole bunch of squirrels heading our way, which means that we cannot have Sangre outside, that's for sure. Let's send you, well, let's draft you, actually, and put you right in there. And you're going to be able to, to hit the first of these. Cathra, let's draft you and put you... Hmm. hmm. Right there. And actually, Sangria, let's put you... Uh, let's put you... Let's reverse that. You're closer. Sangria, let's get you to that door. So we got to see just how many squirrels are in the area. I don't see anything right at, There's one. Okay. You are dead. Never mind. Um... No more little orange dots in here, though. It sent us up into this area, so let's at least go over here. I see a fox. There's a squirrel. So back out, pull down into here, and double click. There's a few squirrels. You are Manhunter. That's probably our first one coming in, but let's click down over here. Okay, you are moving Manhunter. Okay, we're coming into this area. Is anybody else outside? Grandma's not out taming anything, too, right? No names, just Sangria. 
Let's see it outside. Okay, so I guess we're going to war again, but it's a little bit different war than we're used to. The traps are of no use to us this time. So let's get all of the animals into the um, into the main pasture, all out of our uh, turret area. Let's get these turrets turned on. We're actually going to need them this time. All right, from there, everybody who's not already in there. All right, that's good enough. You guys are boom lobes. You guys are all in there. Everybody's going to make a mass exodus into there. We may have a pig or a dog out here. Though I don't think the dogs tend to come out here much, unless they're going for wood. The wood is within the dog zone. Otherwise, we look okay. We're going to be eating squirrel for a while, but they may uh, they may harm us. They can sneak through and around and, and gang up on so this could get a little bit interesting um who is already out here it's so hard to find names faith you are new you are non-violent you will not do violent okay so you just need to you need to trip a switch for me um let's actually just give it this one over here trip you faith you can flick the switch and then you can head in and clean up this area right there since you're on cleaning duty at the moment Klaus, you were playing horseshoes. Needs, your joy is bad. But you've just got married. you still got your plus 50, so we're going to use you anyway. So you are going to draft. Your food was well, decent enough for what we've got going on. Let's get you out of turret range in case this comes in fast. And get you to where? With turrets going on, I can't use this. So we're going to have to come up with a whole new strategy now. Let's get you, if they're going to come through here, they're going to turn and go back, and they're going to come down. Let's go for here for now, until we figure out where best to go. Um, I go this way? Probably so. These are going to be hard to hit, so I think I better get a lot of guns in here. And in this case, really, the, the auto pistols are probably best. We can get you know a quick shot and get out, but Tomislav, you're a good shot. I would love to have this research done, but you're a good shot. Um, Natalia could take your place. Let's let's work on that. Um, needs, you're you're going to have to go hungry. Draft, come on up, and let's get you also down in this area because you're going to take quite a while to get here. Handy, you're in this area. Oh, good. Draft you, and let's get you on the first pass right over here. So whoever's in this area is going to jump into this run everybody else is going to be down in here these girls are quick little boogers too oh we have a grandma over here good you've got a pistol or a, a revolver let's draft you and get you up into this area and who else is over here anybody nobody's close okay so sangria kethra and grandma are our first line of defense not missing anybody we have a sea stars over here melee mm, this could be a good interesting melee experiment it could although we're gonna have turrets on um let's actually there's rapid let's hold off on the turrets on let's use them as a last line of defense faith you cancel that and go on down and just start cleaning down in this area out of turret range okay um sea stars we're best to play with this Let's put you draft into here. And Eric, where are you right now? You're repairing a wooden wall. You're on your way out to something out over here. Okay, that's fine. Draft you, put you up in here too. And David, this would be a good experience for you. You are also repairing a wooden wall. Um, draft and get you up into here. And Kaya? No. Well, let's go with who's, around, who's out here. Rabbit, you are in this area. You can be part of this first line of defense. Let's put you here. And actually, let's put you here. Er. Um, hmm. Here. There. And there. Let's get you... No, actually, right there. They're going to come in from both sides. That's, that's a, a wide open spot right there. Okay, let's do that. So, back to where we were. Handy has been assigned. She's in there also. And she's closer. No, they're the same, basically. Let's get you there. Yep, that works. All right, Rabbit, you're there. Shantigo, you are quite a ways away. 
Good shot, though. I better have you in here as backup just in case. Draft, come on in and park yourself right there. What do, what makes it through you, the melees will take down. Okay, Klaus, you are already assigned. Sangria, you are assigned. Cathra, Natalia, um, going to bed. Er, needs? Yeah, never mind. Michael, you are cooking a fine meal. You, we didn't go to you. You're over there. Okay, good shot and a good fast draw with a pistol. Okay, let's draft you, get you actually right over here as that last line of defense. I think they're going to run this gauntlet fast. I think we're actually going to be out in here. Um, Miss B, you are also down in here. Pistol. Um, yeah, come on out. And pop into here. Alicia's in the hospital. Eric, you are melee. David, you are melee, so you're both assigned already. Grandma is assigned. Sea Stars is melee and assigned. Kaya is um, a good shot and a quick draw. We're through here. We've got a couple in this area. We're coming back. Let's put you actually into that doorway. And we'll use these guys to shoot this way. Then we'll close the door. Then they'll all line up to shoot this way. So we'll take our four, and then we'll use them in two different directions here. I think so. We're done? I think we run the whole group of us. So it's a matter of getting Sangria in in time. Let's keep out so we can see who's moving in. Nobody's coming into view yet. Catherine's in place. Here's our first one. Anything come from above? No, but Rabbit's already in place. And you are going after Rabbit. And I've got to already pull you back. They're, they're fast. Right there. And you're out. You're going to reroute. Okay. We have one coming in there. I wonder how many we have total. I really don't know how to tell because not it may be that not all of them are manhunters, but in that case we've got twenty. At you know, at this range. They're all moving though. They are all moving in. Wish I could zoom out a little bit further. Um Alright, we'll add the one and we'll get you. See if I can grab it this way. There. So you fifteen. So there must be quite a few down in this area. So, 20-something coming our way. Over this way? Any over here? One, and it's moving in too. And these two? They're moving in, I think, every one of them. We got upwards to 30 squirrels, because there may still be more in places that I didn't have on the screen. This is going to be fun. Like I was telling you long ago, I had a game that I was playing just for myself. And there were... The enemy was Boom Rats. And they were coming in from everywhere. And there had to be far more than 30. And oh man, was that <laughs> was that an event. Handy, I think you are going to have to stop. You're... Well, no. Just pause you right there. You just stop right there. Okay. Now these guys are going to have to move in soon. But... Soon, these are going to move up, and you guys can pop back out again. Okay, David, you're in place. Grandma's getting into place. You're going to there. Okay. So, Kathra, you are going to get off one more shot. Although, yeah, that's a problem. Hmm. That's a problem. Sangria could very well shoot Kathra because she's beyond three spaces away. Um, and once she shoots, she's going to have a long timer. I'm going to have to pull Sangria out of it just to... Okay, uh, Cathra, you get out of it now, too. Go, go, go. All right, with that, what happened here? Rabbit, you can pop back out. And we're going to get ready for the first one to come through here. All right, you ran right past, and you're going after Cathra that way. You are on your way in to attack Rabbit that way. You are turning in. I saw you just immediately turn around to go after that. Okay, so... Hmm. I can't. This is not going to be easy to do. Sangria, I need you in a new place now. What is that new place? Um, around that way, around that way. Let's work you into here. How would you do that? You want to do that way. Okay, we'll do that. So that leaves the, the pistols out in this area to go after whatever's going to happen here. Which is... Who's in here? Grandma and Cathra. So, Grandma... Let's get you to here. So you two are not far away from each other. 
and that should be fine. Rabbit, you're going to get off your shot? I don't know if you're going to get back out of there. Well, we'll see if you make it. That's pretty close. You made it. Okay. All right. We turned a corner yet? We have not. So Grandma's going to get into place just in time to get shots off into there. Um, Handy, go up into here. You can shoot as these two pull back away. I think there'll be enough room because the, the chunks will slow them down. I think that will work. Okay. Catherine's getting her first shot. Grandma's getting into place. She'll get a shot. And I need Kathra out. Boy, so close. Grandma, if you hit it, you're fine. If not, you're going to take a bite. Hmm. Let's pull you out, because by the time you get done with your, your cooldown, Handy's already going to be shooting. These guys are quick. It's not like going after pirates and raiders. These guys are actually more dangerous than... than uh, you know, Rimworld squirrels are nothing to be trifled with. Rabbit, let's put you out one more time. And Sangria, soon you're going to be able to help. Klaus is getting into position. Kaya's moving up to help these guys. Um, shields are, are up and running. And <laughs> Who would think a pack of squirrels would be so much fun? Andy, have at it. Boom, boom, boom. Good. Over here, Rabbit got a shot. And you... Oh, over here. And over here. Oh, they're going to come in hard and fast on Rabbit here. And you got your shot off and you're cooling down. All right, I'm going to give you one more round. All right, Handy. I think I've got to get you out. I think... Boy, I don't know. Let's try it. Rabbit, can you make it? And who else can I get in here? They're, all, they're coming in fast. They are. I have a feeling these guys are going to get so overwhelmed. Hmm... I don't know about this. Let's get you guys a little further away. I got the right one, right? David, Kaya. Well, nobody's moving, so David, let's do that. Okay, Kaya, you're going to stay. And I have a feeling that I'm going to have to get the melee folks in a place where the turrets cannot hit. Like down here to fight whatever the turrets failed to, uh, to take down. Not sure about that. All of these turrets can hit over here. Where can we go? Where can we stand that the turrets can't shoot us in the back? These two changed a lot of the rules because we can now shoot straight through here. And this can shoot pretty much straight down. There's one little void probably right in here. That's it. This has got scope of most of this. This can hit all of this area. This can hit everything in there. Hmm. In here. It's probably the safest area for, for melee, but then you're cornered until this is open and another pathway opens up. Hmm. Well, I'll have to think about that. Who would think that squirrels would, would cause a uh, um, a battle to go into, uh, <laughs> into a second episode? <laughs> All right, you have shot. You need to get out. Handy, I didn't get to see. Have you shot? You have. You need to get out. Okay, I don't know what else we can do at this point. These squirrels are getting in. I mean, it'll be safer outside of the base than in the base here in a few minutes. All right, you're, you got them good. All right, Handy, your shots did not, and your timing. Go, 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 go. Woo, that was close. All right, yeah, the gauntlet's filling. Mm. It is filling. Okay, we're coming around the corner here. You guys... <coughs> Hmm. You got doors to get back out of is what I'm thinking. Klaus, I want you... Are you a Klaus? You're a conduit. Klaus, I want you right there. And you can help Rabbit. They're going to come around this corner. We're going to get only a shot or two, and we've got to get out of here for good. We can't dive out sideways. Handy, you're not going to do any good here. You're kind of done. They are going to shoot this way. So, Kathra... And Grandma, you ended up here because you were up in there. So you need to be out here now. Grandma, you need to be out here. Was it Kaya that was heading for that door? Okay, she was. She needs to be in the door. The three of you will kind of line up to shoot into there. So Handy, um, yeah, Handy, I didn't place you. You need to leave now. They're going to go around there. They're going to go around here. They're going to come down. Let's put you over here. 
We'll see how that works out. It's only one shot and you got to leave. You guys will kind of be in place to, to catch this round. And then we could have somebody right here to catch the next round. It's, yeah, it's... <laughs> it's going to be fun. All right. <clears throat> Overall, though, what else is happening? These guys are on their way in. Only one left is Natalia sleeping and Alicia not being taken care of in the hospital. That's the step that I missed. Natalia, i got to wake you up and tend to Alicia. Alicia has no reason to not be on blue medicine. Okay. So, yep. Yeah, that was a lot of time I didn't expect to happen so hopefully we don't get an infection out of that but with klaus having his infection in this hospital bed it was it was not a problem at all and a good chance to use up some of our aging herbal medicines how old are these things now that i'm thinking about it you're good for a year yet <clears throat> okay 54 over there uh the next batch is over here you're good for two years and you're good for a year and a quadrum okay so this is twice as old as this batch over here. So they, they are aging. And the 54, we don't use that much of it in a year. You know, we don't get injured quite as much as, as we could. Of course, I have a feeling we're going to have some, uh, we're going to have a lot of bites this episode, this, this little battle. Okay, so you guys are moving over there. Hannah, you're moving. Rabbit, you are ready for this one. Klaus, you're getting into position for this one. Nobody else is not is unsafe. And the turrets are still off. Eric, you're moving into position. I wish I knew what I'm going to do with our melees. By the time they come up and attack you and you guys get overwhelmed, you're going to just get bitten all the way down trying to get you out of danger so the turrets can be turned on. So I think that's that's not going to happen now. Um, yeah, I really thought we'd have a bunch of dead squirrels in the gauntlet by this point. Okay, you're safe. You're moving out. And you two both together all right i need the two best shots in the colony to take them down and build a wall of of squirrel bodies right there build me a mountain guys thank you let's make this work all right turn in the corner but you're both on timers right now so we're gonna get a lot closer okay that's what we should have had happening but it just didn't work out the timing was wrong for there all right so hmm we could delay them by getting somebody out that door. Handy? Mm, it'd be nice if it was an auto pistol on someone who knows how to shoot. That sounds like a Michael to me. Michael, where did you ever end up? You're just getting here. Michael, I want you theoretically going to there. Quick shots, get out. Quick shots, get out. And even though you're trigger happy, your skill is it's getting up there. You're at a 12 already. So I think, wow, that was moving in fast. Okay, here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Got him. All right. This is finally working. You guys are doing what? You are going after Klaus. You are going after Klaus. What do you know that we don't? Okay, you're going up and around. Now, what's happening here? You are. All right. But I need a pistol in there. I really do. Tomislav. Hmm. I can't get another person in there. I can only get him in the doorway. Yeah. Interesting. Should we put a door here and a door here so we can get that third person in and get him back out and give another way to get out of this little death trap here that we have to dive off either into here or out into the open again? That might be a good plan. I like that. Every battle would come up with a way to improve this area. So we have one coming in <clears throat> that these guys' timers might be a problem. We'll see. The stones help, the, the chunks. Okay, but, oh, good. Rabbit didn't shoot that time, so he gets to take out that one. Oh, but he missed. Okay, Michael's heading in. <laughs> um, yeah, we're getting a little overwhelmed here. We're backing up. We're having a problem. Do I get him out? And do the same thing somewhere else. But where is that else? That else is right here. That's the next one. Everything else is, well, probably right here. It's right here. This is the next area that's like that. It really is. Darn. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, there, there. Well, Rabbit's still got a shot. But Klaus, I'm thinking, is toast after that. How many are alive in here? One, two, three. And three more in rapid succession all coming in. I can't get these guys back into here. There's nothing I can do until the last one comes in that I can get into there. That would be a good idea. Who's the best shot in here? Grandma, uh, you are a five. Kaya's the eight. Kaya, you're heading for here. And you get some quick shots into there. Um, handy. Who else is on their way in? Shantigo is a 10 or 11. You're a 10 still. Okay. You've got a pistol. Um, let's get you into here as well. Who else is on their way in? Miss Pete, you are like a 4 or 5 now? You're 4. Okay. You are moving. What can we do with you as a 4? Tell you the truth, I think you are a switch tripper. I think you are. If you'll hang around long enough and I give up and leave. You're the last one coming in? You must have been the furthest one away. It looks that way. Faith is non-violent. Natalia is healing Alicia. How many? much more medicine? 52 medicine down here. Okay. <clears throat> and that is it. Okay. All the animals are, are still on their way in. Took them quite a while. Okay. So you cannot accidentally shoot us until we are ready. It's just you guys that have got the range for the beginning of the gauntlet. Okay. And you guys are fallbacks if we really blow it. But we've made a lot of progress right there. There's a lot of hunting coming in. Oh, how are we going to get them? We got traps. You know, think about that. We may be disarming. You know, at least these haven't been, been uh, tripped or reset yet. So whatever dies right here, we can get to. Whatever dies in here... I don't know. Well, I hate to destroy a trap. We have to bust open a wall and go get it, then come back out. I don't know. Um, so the decision is what's going to happen here. Rabbit's ready to shoot. That's really close. Close is what accuracy-wise. Um, gear and assault rifle and close. Short is 87. Touch is 70. I think Klaus needs to leave. I think that is the call here go here. I think Rabbit and then Rabbit needs to leave. Um, here? <clears throat> I think so. He's not going to get back into this. That whole pile is going to be coming in. Um, Rabbit could peel off the other side and go in. He could. In fact, Sangria could do that right now too. Sangria's shooting skill now is an 8. Michael, you're over here. And sorry that door hasn't been pulled out yet. We might catch you. Huh. I'm not seeing any more squirrels. Are all that are coming here? The ones that were over here. Let's let's double click on something. Right there. Alright, you're still coming in. You're coming in. Boom. Klaus got bit. You're coming in. You're coming in. Okay, over here. The rest of them are all here. There's nothing else coming from this side. Okay, you got bit from that distance. Interesting. I'm assuming you got bit and you didn't get shot by something. Um, Klaus and health. Squirrel, front paw, front paw, neck and torso. Man, that thing just le leapt into the air and <laughs> did a uh, did a snarling uh, um, gremlin thing on you, didn't it? Okay, well, you're getting out. Rabbit, you're ready to shoot. Got it. Okay. Klaus? Mmm. Let's get you to... I can't get you to... Okay, if I do this... You're still in position. And we lost a meal. But you're ready to fire. Rabbit, you're going here. Actually, you're going... Mmm. How many are in there? One, two. Your firings are going to be staggered. This might still work. This might still work. I didn't reset anything, and you're ready to shoot. If you take down one, and you take down the other, we're good again. Let's give this a try. Missed. Err. Okay. And Klaus, you got to leave. Rabbit may be able to take that one down. He's not going to take the next one down. Okay. You're out of here again. That was... That was Rabbit. No. 
Klaus, you need to get into here. Um, rabbit, go out. We're done with what's outside. And actually, you go out to here because Michael's going to be shooting through. Right? Well, we'll figure that out when it happens. Klaus, you just need to uh, to get out of here best you can. All right. We're out. Okay. So there was that. We're 55 minutes. Yeah, we'll finish this. This may go long, but there's still quite a parade coming in. And there's still that three or four out in here that are, that are working their way in. Don't know where they're at now. There's one. Another one was a little bit further up yet. Yeah, right there. And I think there was a third or fourth one yet. So, with that, Rabbit, come on down to here. You two can take out whatever turns this corner. You two, you three are all going to be... Sangria, you go there. You three are going to take out whatever turns this corner. Alright, so our next round is through here. They're going to... What do you want to bet they stop and eat one of our meals? They're going to turn the corner here. And... I want to say Kaya. Kaya went that way. Okay. Shantiga went to help her. So we're getting close to the end here. Um, Kathra, Grandma, Eric, you're going there. Who else is available to come join us? Um, if Miss P came up to join us, who could tri trigger the uh, um, faith? Would there be time to get faith up here? There might be. Miss P, draft. Come on up into. There we go. Miss P, right there. And let's get Faith right there to draft and head into this position. Uh, this position. We'll do that. Not going to trigger it yet, though. Okay. So you're in place. <clears throat> Shantigo. Miss P, it's going to open the door just in time. I need a fourth gun, though. I really do, and I want Handy to stay here. Who's my fourth gun? That's three. Let's think about all this. I want you two to back each other up at that point, though. So you three are going to be very effective here. So really, my fourth gun's sitting over here, and there's no time to get you there. So, handy, go here and there. All right, someone else is going to have to take Handy's place, which might be Rabbit. But I want to see if these guys can trick any of these to turn around and go somewhere else. Attacking Kaya. Okay, round of the corner yet? You guys are all paused and don't know. Whoa, the whole group is shut down. That's interesting. What's happened here? I am running. There I'm running. Okay. Yep, the whole... Wow. That's a lot of backed up squirrelage. It is. These guys... <laughs> That's going to be interesting. That just might be minigun time. <laughs> I guess, yeah, I would probably have Oath Knight sitting right there with his minigun when he finally gets into the game. And let the ones who can actually shoot kind of shoot around him. And, but make him feel like he's, he's doing something there by, by peppering the whole area with, you know, with this run of a squirrel parade coming in. Alright, can you guys actually do anything? You probably cannot. I was looking to see if any of these would trigger and go backwards because you're outside, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen. But these guys are really backed up. What is the cause here? You are attacking Rabbit. Oh. Can the game not pass them through each other? You want to go up and you want to go down. And we've got a major roadblock here. That is fascinating. You want to attack Rabbit. So Rabbit's holding everybody up. Which is kind of interesting. Michael, you pop out over here. Go up here. And actually, you're going to cancel that. You're going to go here and there. We have noises. Okay. Are you, are you still working your way through? Okay. Now we're moving again. All right. They they chewed through each other's trapped legs or something, and they, they got the roadblock going again. All right, we're coming up around the corner. You guys are all in place. Handy is going to jump in there and help out, but she's got the slowest uh, cooldown time, so I don't want her in the door. I wish I had an auto pistol here. I don't. 
This has got a little bit longer cooldown than the auto pistol. But Mississippi should still get out of there just fine. We'll see how that times out. You guys are all making... You, you, I thought you were eating my meal. Um, turning the corners. Rabbit's out there. And nothing seems to be coming in to affect Rabbit. Okay. Then, Rabbit, you can be here and there. I think... Hopefully I can get you all out of there in time. You may be able to go back up into here. That's possible. You go in and do that. That's where you're going to be when, when they come around. You guys are done? <clears throat> Pull out. No, I need a squirrel, not a trap. Right there. Give me a squirrel. There's a squirrel that's not sitting on a trap. One more. When that last one gets in, then we'll set... Um, Shantigo and Kaya out in here to shoot down the length and maybe cause them all to backtrack. Is anybody backtracking right now? No. The ones that wanted Rabbit are now clearly after Miss B. Zangria. Okay. All right, now turn the corner. First shots are going off. Boom. Do it. Do it, guys. Do it. Do it. Take it down. Take it down. Didn't. They don't have the accuracy of Klaus and Rabbit. That was a good team for that corner. They're, they are... Klaus and Rabbit are all in here now. So hopefully that'll be enough. Michael, you're next. Can anybody jump down there and back up Michael? I don't think there's time. Miss P, you have got a cool down. Then you're going to pull out. You may take one bite. But that'll give those in the back the chance to, uh, uh, to get one more shot off. Michael's going to get probably just one, maybe two shots off. In there... Actually, Michael, you're going here. That way you got a chance to jump outside and help out without getting trapped inside here. Right. Pass by you. Yeah. You could, at the very least, you can jump around and go back into here, maybe. That might work. Okay. So, we're at this point. How many are alive? Um, let's pull back. We're at 18 left. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Oh, took that one down. Good. That bought you the time to get the door closed. And that one went down. Oh, I'd love to try one more time. Um, that would be... Miss P, can you run back in and then run back out just to open the door and close it? And we better actually close that door this time. What happened with this last time with May May? Oh, that drove me nuts. Little glitches like that happen. So you're going to run in and run back out. Just get the door open. Everybody shoots. Pull back out. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay. You're out, Michael. You're up. And when you get out, these four are up. And you guys are officially done, right? Did I miss my opportunity? I did. Okay. Shantigo, you're there. Kaya, you're there. Let's see how many might back up and go back through the gauntlet the other way and stay out of our yard. Let's see if that's possible. Nobody got bit. Good. Michael, that was one shot and two. I think I better get you out. He's moving pretty quick. Do I go any further? No, no, not with that timer. Let's go ahead and and head to, to here. Yeah. You still got, still got a bit anyway. Michael, what'd you take? You took a, a neck and a right leg. Boy, these squirrels, I tell you. So, Rabbit, what did you get? Uh, health. You got a left leg. And uh, Klaus got the neck and left shoulder. No, and torso. And Alicia, how you doing after all that? Natalia went back to bed. She did not. She researching. She's on her way back to bed. Okay. Alicia, health. You had <clears throat> jaw, left arm. How quick are you back to us again? Two, two, four, <clears throat> three, two, and two. Oh, this one, though, is, what is that, 11? So your right hand really got gnawed. All right, so you're out until then. Faith, are you still faithfully standing over here? You are. Let's undraft and redraft, but let's check your needs. Your needs are fine. How are our needs up in here, though? We had a lot of them that were really kind of hungry when that happened. Let's run through the, the group here. Um, Tomasov's hurting, but not his mood, so he'll be fine. Um, Klaus and his mood is fine. Uh, Kathra is going to start suffering soon. we got to keep her in mind. 
and Miss P as well. And she is also, oops, needs, no, what time is it? 10, it's only 10 in the morning. Okay, so I don't have to worry yet. I think it's 11 or 12 when the night owls start to, to freak out a little bit because they're not in bed. Otherwise, Grandma is starting to get down there. Hmm. Yeah. By the time they get to her, it's when it's going to start getting crazy. We'll see. And and Sea Stars, I didn't get as far as you. You're actually needing it right now. Where are you at? You're over here. Your melee. I'm not real sure how to use the melee. I think we got to get the uh, the turrets going. I really do. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use the melee against 18 of these things. I think I better start working with that plan right now. Sea Stars, let's go ahead and let you grab a fine meal. Your plan's going that way. David and Eric. Um, Eric needs. David's needs. Mm. Let's get the both of you where. I'm kind of thinking that you are like down in here in the base. If we get to that point where you can take over what the turrets will not hit and out of turret range. I think so too. If I released both of you and, and brought you back into this later, where would you go? You're both going to play horseshoes and relax socially. Okay. I think that works. That takes care of sea stars too, are, are needing a meal. All right. So with that, Michael, you're out of there. Return to the corner. It's these guys next. And it's you guys to see if anybody turns back. Anybody going uphill over here? Well, keep that in mind. And I do need to actually be aware of that. So far, the answer is no. But you're going to turn the corner right there, and you guys are going at them. So I'm hoping we're going to end it all right there. All those shots, and we didn't hit them. Urgh. Okay, that worked. Now we have four or five that are not drafted anymore that could, without me realizing it, just walk right outside and go fix a wall. So I've got to watch that. You're next. Took a shot, slowing down. Next. Oh, come on, guys. Really? We can't go up in here? Or can we? You the last one? You're the last one. We have two of them here, though, and one there. I want to see if I can get back up into here at all. Hmm. It's a long run down of bites to get out this door. I didn't think they'd get that close. We got... We got Tomasov, Rabbit, and Klaus in here. And they're good shots. Sangris is fairly good, but Rabbit and Klaus are really good, and Tomasov's good too, and wow, the the chunks really protected them, didn't they? Yeah. Michael, you're over here, and I'm going to wait. They shouldn't be able to shoot each other. This one should be able to shoot that one, even though they're starting to... Yeah, I think we're I think we're okay, but this round over here worries me. Good. And this one? I think i got to start getting them out of here. We're going to start piling up on them. Okay, we're clear here. One click tap. You're the last one right there. All right. Um, Tomislav, you're going there. Klaus, you're going all the way through. You two. What's faster? I'm thinking that Tomislav's going to trigger the door. It's going to close, and Sangria's got to then re-trigger the door. I think I better get the three of you down into here. All right, let's get moving. Boom, boom, boom. Tomislav, go. Okay, with that, Michael, you're next. Um, Klaus, anybody get more bites? Tomislav, got a right leg, a right shoulder, no immediate danger. Crack from a squirrel head. Cracked your right femur. Wow. <laughs> so, Rabbit, anything new? No, Michael, you got that, I don't remember when you got bit. And, all right, so nothing new over there. So, we're rounding this corner here. Sea Stars is doing what? Fleeing. You ran inside. You went to get this meal. Um, needs. Okay. Sea Stars, let's get you 
draft, undraft, and let's get you over to take this meal. What's that going to do for you? You're good. Okay. The other guys. David and Eric, you're down there. Okay. Um, Faith, you're still right there. Okay. You guys are in place, and it hasn't done you any good. Nobody is going backwards. You're going backwards in the gauntlet. Okay, it did happen. So with that, you're going there. Majority are there. I can almost put you guys back in over here. Okay, so Tomasov, you're okay for now. Um, you guys are all backed up. Klaus, if I put you into here and then back right there, what would happen? You all went backwards. Interesting. Yeah, you're going to make this a long episode, aren't you? Yeah. I can honestly see another 20 minutes here. I really can. I think we've got to call this one part one. Sorry about that, but we're already an hour and ten into this. So, yeah, this hour and a half videos take a long, long time to edit and render and upload and yeah it, it just gets it makes things far more complicated so there's what we're up against and next time we'll conclude this this has been noble rambler catch you later folks bye bye mm -hmm.